really excited to be here. Um, we're filled with amazing people. Uh, we're making a huge difference, and it's a beautiful day. I find no greater enjoyment in life. Um, there's something about when you're doing hard labor along people you enjoy, or when you see the gratitude on someone's face just because they couldn't do by themselves, whether it's shoveling their sidewalk or raking their yard because they can't physically do it. Circle K's motto is, you know, live to serve, love to serve. So, you know, it's our duty as members to go out, go around the country and help people that may be in need. And this is one of the ways that we do it. Uh, I think it's a great chance to meet people and serve together. I think service brings people together. And so it's a great chance to meet people from all over the country and have fun while well doing it. It's just nonstop service and nonstop fellowship. And that's really what Circle K is about. And we're just getting so much done and meeting so many new people that it's, it's a blast. I keep coming back because the service is awesome um, and you really get to meet new people and by serving with the other people you really get to make some great friends. Today we're working for Habitat for Humanity in Birmingham and we are working on reconstructing um, some houses with um, elderly people that kind of can't keep up with um, the maintenance of their homes so we're doing some painting. We're trying to dig around maybe 20, 25 mailbox posts. Um, we're going to try to uproot some of the some of the old ones and then put them into the new posts um, so that people could have more mailboxes and more access to those mailboxes. It's been really neat for us today because we've got to see some of the families and kind of talk to the people so you really um, get to see who gets, who gets to be benefited from these projects. I know it's kind of corny but I definitely think that teamwork represents all of LSSP because we couldn't do this without each other. I mean, it was just one of us trying to paint and scrape. I mean, people are handing paintbrushes to each other, refilling the paint, and I think we're all working together and kind of, you scratch my back, I scratch yours, and we're getting a lot of work done. Today we're helping out the gardens here, and basically what we're doing is we're pulling up tomato plants and all the weeds around the tomato plants to help uh, clear out the garden for them so they can start a new harvest. I mean, it's great. It's a huge help. Uh, it's Having people willing to come out and work in this heat um, for a morning or for a day is, uh, you know, Katie and I are the only paid staff, full-time staff here, but it would be impossible for us to get everything we need to get done if it was only the two of us working. We're at the Big Brothers Big Sisters of Birmingham, and we are basically help, helping them straighten up the whole place and just helping them clean it up. Basically, it's just a big organization project for today, and just helping them get back organized I really enjoyed the Ecoscape yesterday. We got to learn um, a lot of things about the environment that I didn't know before, and I got to help clear out a garden we weeded, and then the guy told us that um, today a, kid of, a group of homeless kids are coming to do the garden. So I felt really good that we helped make it pretty for them to get a chance to enjoy it. So the students this morning are, are helping with this because Alabama is a lush state in terms of being semi-tropical, so after a little bit of rain, three days later, it's, it's just the amount of weeds that come up, etc are amazing. So you guys were a godsend. You came just in time. Today we are cleaning out the children's pig pen. Uh, moving about 152 feet of dirt. They're going to refill it in with new dirt. It's really a big help because the zoo volunteers focus on the animals and if we can focus on the animals habitat they can do more for the animals and make Birmingham Zoo a better place. So this is a really motivating experience. Um, we're seeing lots of kids around, they're having a great time, and we know that we're making the zoo a better place, and that makes all of us happier to serve. Well, this is my second LSSP, and I had so much fun last year, you know, serving, and my favorite part of Circle K is just doing the service and, you know, getting my hands dirty, as you can tell. So, the fact that, you know, that all these days are dedicated to pure service is, is what got me to come here. It was amazing to see such a large group, um, so active, so engaged, so interested. So that says something about your organization. There's people that always need help, and I think it's important that, that you help others, and it makes you feel good too. I just enjoy the service and the fellowship. Uh, this is my fourth year. So. Enjoy traveling over, all over the country for. It shows that um, the more the merrier and the more people that are involved in getting hands on it just everyone stays enthusiastic and excited and a job gets done really quickly and really well. I think I'm going to take back um, just how blessed I have been and then how 
and I can share and help someone else have a great life just like I have. I think the one important thing I'll take back home with me is that there is a sense of dedication to the community, um, not just you know where I'm from, but all over. Take off work, tell your family you're leaving, and hop on a plane because it's a blast. You have not come to LSSP. Change, change your decision. Get here. It is going to be the best four days of your life. Yeah.